This is Veronica Wells from MadamNoir.com, and today's Madame Noir Street question is, what's your worst crazy ex story? The worst one I could say out of all minds is that she probably treated me like one of her exes who did her wrong and didn't realize that I was a different person. Um, well, when my ex was living with me, um, in the car that I bought, <laughs> he went to go see another girl. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I think, like, one time, like, I was trying to leave the house and he didn't want me to leave the house and he started crying and I just looked at him like he was... That's crazy to me, like, when... I don't know. That's, like, the worst thing I could think of. Taking care of a woman that had no job, putting property and vehicles in this woman's name, and when she's ready to leave, she takes it all. My ex-fiance was trying to get me and another girl pregnant at the same time and was engaged to both of us at the same time. Yes, so I guess that would be my crazy guess. When I meet honeys, I tell them, like, yo, I'm true. I'm no good. I'm probably going to be out. I want to mess with as many honeys as humanly possible. But if you want to rock, rock. They want to rock, clearly. And then when I prove to be what I say I am, they didn't want to stab me. This is the scar. This is a stab wound. Light kitchen knife stab wound. Nothing crazy. Did you leave her after that? Did you still? Did you still? Nah. Why would you leave? No. It was a little sexy wound. Like, yo, just chill. Did you, still, did you still mess with her after that? Yeah. That's it for this edition of Madam on the Street. You can catch Madam on the Street on MadamNoir.com every Tuesday. In the meantime, subscribe to our YouTube channel at YouTube.com backslash Madam Noir for more videos.